how we doing? Jay here. Biggest tool ever, as you can see what I just posted. I just got a message in my phone, what could it be? Oh, that's fucking random. Anyways, bringing you some Cheese Vikings gameplay. And I'm running my near scheme, and I'm just running the HP inside all day for the majority with a little shotgun. But after I'm in the Tom Laundry, Laundry playbook, I'm totally switching to John Madden after what I've just seen from Madden Lab, the Gamers Lab. And and this guy is actually in a 3-4, and he's, and he's, uh, and I notice I'm not going to be able to run that toss probably at all this game. So I'm just going to keep pounding the HP inside because I have so much faith in this play because I can cut it up the middle, take my four to five yards, and it can go right, and I can go left, and I can get touchdowns everywhere. Love this play. I, the Madden 10 and the Madden 11 game is back alive in me. I didn't play Madden 12. I fucking hated Madden 13, or Madden, yeah, 13. And now we're on Madden 14. Look at that little whatever. And, oh, look at that! I run the, and then if, on defense, I run the cheesiest, ooh, Eric Berry just dropped that pick. I run the cheesiest defense in the world. If you're a tournament, if you know anything about tournament play in Madden, you know what I'm running. If you don't, I'm not even going to talk about what I'm running. Then where we get the sack when he's handing it off. Houston coming in on that cheesy shit. And then there he hits me on the quick pass. And what I want to talk about. Before I keep commenting on the plays going, I want to talk about one thing. I was watching Mike and Mike this morning, and, uh, we're talking about trading Adrian Peterson. All right, he's 28 years old. He only has a couple more years left probably in him where he's going to be what he's doing because why? Running backs, you know, or whatever, they don't last long. So he should get traded to a contender, and and if I was a Viking fan, you'd say, why, why would you ever do that? The Cowboys, 1988, started off the season 0-5, realized they're a horrible team, just like the Vikings now at the moment. This is the play. There's a play coming up. All right, and then, anyways, sorry, I've been drinking beer, so I'm a little, <laughs> I'm a little out of my element. Wait, where's this play coming? Here it is, here it is, Jamal Charles! Good. Go. I'm going to ruin it for you already, all the way. So the, the Cowboys in 1988 had Herschel Walker trade him to the Vikings. What did the Vikings, what did the Vikings trade the Cowboys in return? Well, you know, just three Super Bowl rings. Michael Irvin, Troy Aikman, Emmitt Smith. I can just think about it. Right, that's my thought of that. In to the gameplay, near formation, legendary playbook. If you're running a legendary playbook, you are the man. This is the greatest offense in the world. And then here, he's. I'm actually never used to people being. If you saw that first drive, now he's running the counter. Apparently, the counter in the pistol formation works really good. And here he is running it on me again. Running it on me again. Just no huddle in, no huddle in. I'm getting it set. It's actually working on me. And then here. I can't believe Eric Berry dropped that pick. That's why I hate playing on all pro. But I've been, I'm trying to get in the top 100 right here. I want to be in that top 100. Somebody's Facebook messaging me. What is going on? And then there I dropped that pick. I didn't even turn into him. I deserved to drop that pick. But we hold him to a field goal. We hold him to a field goal. And then why don't we're going to do 2.30 left. He gets ball at halftime. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to play. We're going to play no homo offense. Heard a no homo defense, why well, we call this no homo offense. HB inside. What do we get? What do we get right there? We got four yards. We're gonna take it here. I was thinking he's been playing man that's gonna be open. Yeah, he stuck with him that time. Then we get hit stick. And then here, what do we run? Oh, we got the HB. I don't even know what that is. Trips weak though. That's formation in the game. They're not trips weak. Whatever. Trips formation, especially if the running back's on the same side as the trips and they're running man. You can throw that all day to that running back. Put him on a wheel route all day. Uh, then here, what do we got? Take it. Oh, we got Chase Daniels in the game. I forgot my dude got hurt. All right, this is the worst commentary in the world. But enjoy it. Enjoy it. If you're new here, hit the like button. No, I don't care if you hit the like button. But if you're watching, subscribe to me. Subscribe to me. So uh, I've been doing this for a year now. And I have a, I'm about to hit that 200 video. And I'm averaging 1.5 subscribers or so to a video. I want to get a little more now. Because I really enjoy this. It's a hobby of mine. I just... Almost to 300 subscribers. To you guys that have been here, I love you all. Shout out. We're running there. And then there, we get the touchdown. We're going up 21 and 10 at half. And one thing, you know, kickoffs or whatever. So I always do this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, it's going to Oh, I can't even believe I used something for Mortal Kombat because we're all about the Street Fighter. Street Fighter football is going to come alive, I think. 
And then here, HB inside, remember? This is my favorite play. This, it's such a versatile play because you can cut it left, you can take it up the middle, or you can cut it right. And it's such a home run play, especially if you have somebody with some speed. If the Vikings were any good in this game's Gears Madden, I would, like I'm about to get close to the top 100, I would be in the top 100 because nobody would shut down my running game. Or, but I need a defense to go with that running game with Adrian Peterson. Anyways, Hadouken! We get the Hadouken! The Street Fighter football is alive, folks. It is alive. Dante Robinson, it's just, now he's recovered two fumbles. Here, we're abusing that HB inside because I'm just taking it. And then there, Madden Lab, shout out, QB rollout, split close. Here, running up the middle, hitting our yards. HB inside, cutting to, oh, that could have been big. I got horse tackled. It's still running it, still running it. Favorite play in the world. There, we finally hit the toss. He was, uh... Spreading it, he's in a 3-4 and spreading his out linebackers to the outside. The 3-4 can slow it down. And then here, we're still in the near. We're running my makeshift screen made for the running back. But I make it to the fullback and I set up a lot of lead blockers. And we're going up what? A lot to a little. We're at 35-10. Eric Berry. Uh-oh. 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 We're slow. Sharyuken! We hit the Sharyuken. We hit the Sharyuken. This game is already about over. I know it's a blowout, but I wanted to upload. I'm getting close to the top 100. I should be uploading more games. And he's going to be a homo. And I would like to say, Voya con Dias Bras. You want to eat some chicken? Oh, there you go. I'm sorry, I read the text. I'm freaking. And I got four points. This guy sucks. You know, I can't always choose my opponents. And there we are. We were at one. I actually didn't move up a single spot because I was at 214. And I went up to 28.